concerts last night just like I had planned cause I was so excited for me to finally grab all of them deals but today I drove to eight different CBS's trying to look for clearance <laughs> everyone it's Jacob the New England couponer um, what am I saying? Hey, it's Jacob, the New England Coupon character, aka Couponer Jacob. I'm back, 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 back again with another CVS haul. Happy 4th of July. That's right. These are the CVS coupon deals for the week of July 4th through the 10th. Um, well, not all of this. This, like, tiny little last row on the left here is just from last week. I wanted to just have it here, though, so you guys know I didn't slack off last week. I just... Didn't get around to making a video. By the time it was Monday night, I figured, eh, I'm kind of lazy. And then it was Tuesday and I was like, Ugh, what's the point of making a video? Like all the deals are pretty much out there that I did. So I just didn't post my videos last week. Um, anyways, definitely follow me on TikTok at Coupon or Jacob. I'm going to try to be like rushing through this video because I don't want this to be like 50 minutes long. So definitely follow me on there and I'll have like a deal by deal on there. But I wanted to just get the the full little haul over here. So again, TikTok at Coupon or Jacob. I've gotten a lot of followers and I've only posted a few videos on there. Well, like two or three weeks of like deals. But um, give a follow over there. I would really appreciate it. Okay, so for this week, everything you see before you, and that's not including this like last row here. It's the crest, I mean the Colgate total is part of this but all of like that stuff if you can see like what I just exed out there not exed out outline there um is not included in this otherwise it's probably another like 200 250 bucks more but anyways everything else would have been a retail value of $1,018.66 bananas I know bananas um, out of pocket, I paid a lot more than I was hoping to that I planned on paying, but it's okay. Ended up getting some good stuff at least. Um, I paid $57.39 out of pocket this week. And again, you're thinking like, mm, like, why did you pay that much? But it's okay. I, um, I got some good stuff over here. That'll be some good donation items, but there are about $20 in issues, maybe even $25. So really, it should be like 20, 25 bucks less. Um, I had one transaction that was like 21, 22 dollars, and it should have been like a dollar or two dollars. And that's it was my first transaction, and that's where I had most of my issues. And it was like all of these deals. But let me do the clearance first because you're all probably thinking like, ooh, like let's see all of this. So I went to only I went to eight different stores, like I said to try to look for clearance um because I found like an area where there was like five stores within like a 15 mile radius so I was just stopping at each one to see what I could get only one store that I went to and it was actually the smallest store I went to had these oh so soft four packs of toilet paper let me show you the UPC in case you're curious so it's these four packs of Oh So Soft. Only one store had them and they had like an entire top of the shelf worth. So I just, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna grab all of them. <laughs> so I got like 21, 22 packs of um, these. These are 49 cents a piece. So for four rolls, that's like 12 and a half cents a roll. Not even, like 12.25 cents a roll. So let's just say, tw excuse me. Whoa, what was that? That was a Wendy Williams moment. Um, <laughs> that was so gross, I apologize. So that's 12 cents a roll for those. Wow, I really am Wendy Williams. Okay, these Kleenex Jumbo Rolls. Again, I only found this at one store, but these were 18 cents, I believe. Um, and then all of these like hand sanitizers and soaps, and they go all the way back. I did get some cardboard so I could stack them there. They're 29 cents a piece. So for 32 ounces of this soap, um, one store only had this scent, but all of the other ones had this one. Um, they're not in like the normal area where you would think they would be. So what I did, I went to a few stores that I never go to. I've 
never gone to some of them actually. I just like walked the perimeter of each store, looked at all the end caps, see, looked to see if there were any like special bins in the aisles. So each store differed of like where they were located. Um, here's the UPC on these 32 ounces. Um, so that was for the Kitchen Fresh. This is for the Lavender. No, I'm done. They're not the same. <laughs> um, so I got like 40-ish of those, which is pretty good. And I forgot to show you the Kleenex, which I had no idea Kleenex made. I assume this is toilet paper. I don't know. That's just what I assumed. Um, okay, and then these were all 29 cents a piece as well. The Safe Harbor. This was 16 cents, but I figured, hey, might as well. Um, a bunch of stores had these, like, right in front of the pharmacy. So maybe try to look for there if you are having a hard time finding um these, oops, sorry. And, uh, definitely look for expiration dates on these. Um, some of them were like beginning of 2022. So I tried to grab the ones that were like as far back as possible. Each store was different. I think the farthest back was like March, 2023 of that one I just showed you. And I got a few of those. So definitely check those expiration dates. It's probably fine to use them past them, but um, these ones I'm probably going to definitely be donating. Um, but I figure, hey, might as well pick them up for 29 cents. Probably the best we're going to get them. Um, it's not Purell. Purell definitely is the best, but hey, whatever. Um, these were also 29 cents. And I apologize if you don't care about the clearance. Uh, I would skip ahead another like minute or two. So this is the 16 ounce, this deep moisture liquid hand soap. Here, sorry about the weird lighting, is the UPC on that. Oh, and it has a little hope on it. Very cute. Ooh, NTC. Interesting. Okay. The N-E-Q-I. I don't know how to pronounce it. It's 16 ounces. There's the barcode there. I mean, if you're just looking at the ounces, these are definitely, the Arm & Hammer ones are definitely the best. And then here is the Amelia liquid hand soap. These are also 16 ounces. Another store I went to had more of the NEQI, -E I don't know, but um, they had 12 ounce ones, and, but they were more clear of a bottle. Here's the UPC on the Amelia. Sorry about my hands. <laughs> um, and then the Germex. I think this is probably the best because these are like, everyone needs like little bottles of hand sanitizer. They're good for back to school. Um, most of the ones I tried to get expired in August of next year. So um, definitely going to try to give most of these away. And these were 29 cents as well. And then we have the Persani. Persani? I don't know. This lighting is really weird. I apologize. So these are four ounces. Um, definitely make sure you scan, scan, scan everything. Just to triple check your store has those prices as well. It's weird, it rings up like 0.289999 at the um, red box or the price scanner, but um, they just rung up 29 cents at the register. I did have a dollar off two CRT for the Kleenex single rolls. It didn't work though and the cashier handed me back the coupon, but it was 18 cents anyways, so I was like, eh, whatever. Um, so I had one dollar off two CRT. I was gonna see if I could use it, but didn't work. But oh well, whatever. So again, toilet paper packs, those are 49 cents. Everything else was 29 cents, I believe. They may have, something may have been 39 cents. 
but maybe I'm losing my mind. Oh, I don't know if I showed you guys these. This is more um, hand sanitizer. There's the UPC there. sanitizer. I don't know why they need to emphasize that, but okay then. Um, I mean, these have more in it, 16 ounces, compared to the 8 ounces of those, but I feel like they probably are more... It's like weird. I don't know. Okay, <laughs> that was a very weird um, tangent, and I know I said I wanted this video to be quick, and it's been 10 minutes already of me looking at hand sanitizer, but isn't it so pretty to look at? Like, look at all of that. I could have grabbed more, but I left a decent amount at each store. There was actually um, an employee who was like vacuuming when I was looking at this stuff and they were like looking at it too once I was looking at it. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. Like, am I in the way of you vacuuming or something? And they were just like, oh no, I, I want to get some of those too. So I, I left way plenty for them. Um, there was also another person in one of the CVSs I went to, and I told, I told like everyone in the store, I was like, all of this stuff is 90% off, like go and grab it. Um, but I didn't know about this Arm & Hammer at first, and they told me about it. So shout out to that person. Thank you to them um, for telling me that. Okay, now here are like the actual regular deals of the week, not clearance items. Um, so the Ben & Jerry's, they're not out. I put them in the freezers where they were gonna melt because this, this you'd be surprised how long it took me to set all of this up, like a sad amount of time. Okay, anyway, so the Ben & Jerry's, they were $6.49, I believe. I had like 20 receipts and I was too lazy to like verify, but I'm pretty sure it was $6.49. Um, I had a buy one, get one free ice cream pint CRT and I had a four off of two um, Ben & Jerry's CRT. And I was like, mm, are they gonna work together? And I went to self-checkout and they both actually came off. So it ended up being $2.49 for two of them. $1.24, pretty good for Ben and Jerry's. And I am on a diet. I got the COVID plus 20 pounds on the scale. I am trying to lose it. I have lost some of it. So I'm trying to cut down on that type of stuff, but Ben and Jerry's is like too good to pass up sometimes. Okay, the paparazzi nail. Um, they're two for five. One of my cards, I had a $1.50 off a $5 paparazzi nail. Um, CRT came to three fifty. Got back the four plus the beauty club, making that a nice little money maker. And then CVS, they're doing their free thing every week. Um, and that are the that's these um, beauty three sixty nail perfectors or like the cotton swabs, I think. Um, so just two of my cards, I like, clipped it to them. Okay, the razor deal. Here is where things really went berserky, <laughs> and I just made that word up. Um, but for some reason, like, there was just an issue. What I think happened um, was my cashier forgot to scan one of the skin timits. That's why I have four of them. So I did return one of them. But I did know there was possibly going to be an issue because I, I know the um, four of a two skin timit CRT attaches to these vanilla sugars. I was hoping they would be 1029 at my store. Like, I swear, CVS, half the time when they do the spend deals, like spend 15, get five, like with the skin to and Schick, um, you kind of want them to be higher priced sometimes, so that way you meet the threshold. But these were $9.29 at the store I did most of my, like, couponing at. So um, I improvised, and I got these $10.49 ones. It took me, like, forever, because the reception in CVS... It just sucks for some reason. But um, I noticed the CRT wasn't attaching to these when I scanned them on the app. So I knew there would be a risk of that, but there was even more of an issue because one of them wasn't scanned. I have three of them and not four because I did end up returning the one because it wasn't worth it in my opinion. So I, uh, I'll show you this and <laughs> that'll you'll know a little bit better. So the scenario I was planning on doing, I planned on doing it twice, was to get two skin to mitt, two Gillettes. Um, so if the skin to mitt, it's ten forty nine and nine twenty nine is what I was planning on it being. It'd be fifteen dollars and thirteen cents. Two of the Gillettes at ten twenty nine. I had a four of a twenty shave CRT, two three dollar manufacturer coupons for the Gillette or the Venus back there um, from this week's P and G, 
And then I had a four off of two skin to mint and chic. Everyone's getting that uh, digital coupon. So it should have been, um, well, what it ended up being on one scenario was $21.71. Get back the 15. But I, w I was planning on using, um, I had a four off of two CRT and I had a five off of four CRT. Um, but those didn't come off for some reason. So that's why it was more. See, I'm, I'm even confused now looking at it. So I know for one though, my four off of two CRT, this is the one where one of them didn't scan. Uh, my cashier forgot to scan one of them. The four off of two CRT didn't come off because of that because I only had one of them. Or actually, yeah, I only had one of them. Um, the four off of 16, I had four off of 16 Gillette instead of the four off of 20 Shave that I was planning on using didn't come off um, for some reason, but I guess that didn't have to do with it not scanning. And then the five off of four, like Oral Care Shave didn't come off because I only had like three items um, when it only scanned once. And then my four off of two digital coupon for the Skin Timid didn't come off as well. So I ended up paying $29.71, getting back to the 15. So like 15 bucks for four razors. I mean, for a non-couponer, that's probably pretty good. That's less than $4 a pack. But for a couponer that has like plenty of razors, this was not great. Um, so once you factor in like the half off item with those coupons, if it was scanned, um, I paid $13 more out of pocket because of that issue, which is unfortunate. Um, but I knew the four off of two CRT might not have come off on the skin to mitt. Um, so I was prepared to pay $4 more for two different transactions. But regardless, um, yeah, meh. I really, I guess I could have skipped it this week and I, I would have paid a lot less out of pocket. But, you know, we moving on. <laughs> okay. I'm rambling. Okay, the PNG at spend 30, you get 10 this week. I did it three different scenarios on three different cards, mix matching the 10 packs, the always, and the bounty. First scenario I did was get four of the always or 10 packs. Those are two for eight, two of the bounty at 9.99. I had a three out of 15 tampon pads for liner CRT and a four out of 20 paper product CRT. I had a two dollar bounty CRT as well. And then, so there's three off of two um, tan packs are always paper coupons in this week's PNG. And then there's matching digital coupons. And then there's paper coupons dollar off for the bounty. Came to twelve ninety eight. Get back ten. Two ninety eight is a really awesome price because it's like saying, okay, if you get those for free, then it's a dollar fifty a pack for the bounty, which is awesome. The other scenario I did was I got six Pantene at three for twelve, and I got two always at two for eight. Um, I did it this way because I had a 3 off of 18 hair care CRT on this card. And then I had, there's 5 off of 3 Pantene uh, paper coupons from this week's PNG. Same deal with the matching paper coupon and digital coupon for the always. Came to $13, get back the 10. I was planning on it being $11. So that's $2 more right out of pocket I paid in cash or card, whatever you want. Um, but $2 more I paid out of pocket um, because I was planning on, I had a $2 off like a pads or tampons CRT but it just it didn't come off for some reason maybe it's because that transaction I got the liners and maybe the CRT didn't include the liners I think that's probably what happened maybe but I don't know so I was planning on it being 11 get back the 10 but it was 13 get back the 10 for me um the other scenario I did was I got six of the always or tan packs and then I got one of the bounty at 9.99 Again, matching digital coupons and manufacturer coupons, but for this one, for some reason, the three dollar one three dollar digital coupon didn't come off. So two of them came off, but the one on the liners I don't think came off for some reason. I'm I don't exactly know why. I did have a two off of sixteen feminine care CRT um, for this one, and then again the dollar off the bounty. So it's fifteen ninety nine. Get back the ten. Not horrible. Not like as bad as the razor deal went, but. Um, it could have been $12.99, give back the 10, which is what I was planning on it being. So another $3 more out of pocket that I paid there. So that's another like five bucks and issues that happened there. And then here is where I didn't expect there to be issues, but I should have known. I was trying to scan the toothpaste in the store for like 
the life of me. Like I was scanning every single one, but my app just kept freezing and crashing and I kept opening it. And then I had no reception and I was like squatting. I was standing up. Like I was trying to do everything I could, but it just didn't work for some reason. So this stick, you know, it's a little bit of a mess. But the scenario I was planning on doing was getting four Colgate toothpaste at $3.99, one toothbrush, I think um, $6.29, one mouthwash at $5.99. I was planning on doing that on two different cards. Five off of 25 Colgate CRT did come off that I had. I had a four off of two digital coupon um, for the Colgate, a $2 off a digital coupon for the Colgate, and then 75 cent printable coupons from Colgate.com. For the toothbrush, the mouthwash, and the toothpaste, I just used one of each of them. So it ended up being um, $14.99, get back $12 and $6. And that's the one where I got the total. So the optic white isn't working for the 4 off of 2 CRT, excuse me, the 4 off of 2 digital coupon. So on um, the other card I did the scenario on, it was $18.99, get back $18. And then one of my cards, I didn't have the $2 digital coupon, I think, because it was maybe from last week, or I just didn't clip it or something. I don't know. So that was $16.99, get back $18. Um, actually, yeah. So $16.99, get back $18, one card, because I had the 4 of 2 digital coupon come off when I got these. Um, but the $2 digital coupon, I didn't load it or I didn't have it or whatever. And then the other one... Um, that I only got the optic white, the four of two digital, digital didn't come off, so it was $18.99. The one scenario that um, worked out the best um, was I just got four of the Colgate toothpaste at $3.99. I had a four off of two digital coupon, and then I had um, two dollar off one digital coupon again, 75 cent internet printable coupon. I used one of them. I had a four of two Colgate CRT from last week, and then I had that five of a four oral care deodorant, or I don't know if it includes deodorant, but I know it's at least oral and shave. So I was planning on it being 21 cents, get back the 12. Again, the four off a two didn't come off because I got the optic white. So it was an, ended up being 421, get back the 12. So don't get the optic white, get the total. You'll thank me. <laughs> I would thank um, myself. Okay. Then we have... The Monofoil D, this is a really simple deal. Um, you kind of have to look around for these, at least at the store I would got these at. But it's $9.99. You get back a $9 extra buck this week, so only $0.99 cents a piece. Pretty good. Um, and then the Poise Ultra Thin pads, they are $5.99 on sale this week. There's a $3 digital coupon on um, the app, on CBS's app. And then you get back a $2 extra buck, I believe, and there's a dollar Ibotta. I still got to submit the dollar Ibotta, but that makes those free. I think it's limit one per card, but my my memory could be fading me right now. It's like, it's almost 11 p.m. Um, and I was literally out shopping at eight different stores pretty much all day. So I'm a little over it, <laughs> if I'm being honest at this point. And then all of the, this other stuff was from last week. So there's no point in going over those deals because they're no longer available, but I thought I would just include it for the aesthetic, for the look, for the haul, you know, so you know I wasn't dead. Okay, so again, everything you see here, retail value this week, not including that stuff for there, over $1,000. I paid like a little under 60 bucks, um, but again, there was like 20 to $25 in mistakes with different digital coupons and CRTs and an item not scanning, which messed me up. So, um, yeah, that's that. But the one thing that makes up for it, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh, I don't feel like counting all of them. <laughs> but um, all of these 49 cent packs, I wish each store had them because I literally would have gotten them at every, all of the eight stores I went to and I could have had like a hundred of these four packs, um, which I would have probably, donate at least half of them but um yeah a lot of this stuff is going to be donated at the end of the summer all right thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share comment and subscribe i don't youtubers don't say that anymore i don't know why i say it but i'm in the habit of it because <laughs> i've been doing this for way too long like i said follow me on tiktok at couponer jacob and hopefully hopefully if i can get it together i will see you all next week bye